name is Andy Barnaba and I do production here at CIUT. CIUT is a radio station based in downtown Toronto. It's the UFT radio station and it's been around, I believe, for over 20 years. Back in the day when they first started, you could only hear it on campus, like in the cafeterias and stuff. And then they applied for a spot on the FM dial and that failed and then they did it again and then it succeeded and they used to be located in a house on St. George and then they moved to Hart House. My name is Eric Betlam. I've been at the station for about three years now. I'm a producer slash assistant technician and I pretty much run everything behind the show. It's station is uh, reaching its 25th year. It's been really rocky. There's been ups and downs, but overall the station is steadily having an increase in listenership and quality. We've transcended college campus radio station, now we're a community radio station, which means we provide a service for the community, which in our case is all of Toronto. We don't try to imitate larger radio stations. We have our own unique alternative brand. We play different music, we talk about different things. Say everyone started playing hardcore punk in Toronto on all the major radio stations, we'd have to start playing Lady Gaga. So we're just the opposite. CIUT has been for a long time, it is a community radio station. Even though UFT doesn't have a radio program, they do provide a radio station where students can come in and volunteer and get the experience that is needed to find a job in the future, whether it's in the broadcasting section or behind the scenes. So it is a great way for people to get involved. I've always been into radio. I love radio and I've always wanted to work in it. And I'm a student at U of T, so it just made sense to start at a U of T radio station. My friend was working here and she said that they had a opportunity available. They needed a volunteer to work in reception. So I was like, I'm on it. Because then I thought, you know, if I meet enough people, I would maybe get to do some other cool stuff. It's very broad. Um, most of the hosts here at the station get to choose what they play on the radio in the sense of music. It plays a lot of alternative music that you can't find anywhere else. At CAUT you can play anything from Canadian to American, um, worldwide music. There's a couple of shows that have, for example, Ken, the station manager, he has his show where he plays music from all over the world. Um, they also have the talk aspect, the talk radio, where people get to talk about democracy and voice their opinion, which you don't get at every station. Before I came to CIUT, most of the stuff that I used to hear was pop or rock, uh, where here they play everything from alternative to rock, indie, so I really like that aspect of the station. I was in high school and I needed something fun to do. and engineering was looking really boring so I stayed an extra year and went to a co-op program and they put me in the radio station because that sounded like fun and after that I didn't want to leave I went to school for it and now I've moved up the ranks. There is a co-op program where you get to come in for a whole semester. You do get your school credits for it and basically you get the experience of a real job at a radio station, you get to do stuff from reception to production to working with bands, setting up and recording and editing. It's a great experience and anyone who's into or would like to get into radio, this is a great opportunity. CIUT needs your support, so please donate to our spring membership drive by calling... Uh, we're just gearing up for our membership drive right now. It runs all of next week and during it we try to get people to become members of the station and the way they do that is by donating. A huge part of our revenue comes from the membership drive. It's the biggest thing we do here, it's a huge production. We try to get everyone excited, we make an event of it, we have phone room volunteers, it's kind of like a PBS kind of thing. All the shows just keep like mentioning it throughout the show, completely different format, we do it twice a year, tons of fun.